Oh, hello. I assume you clicked on this because you have a flair for the domestic life. Well, I have good news for you. We have some predictions for the home economics. Yes. Now, if you're going to be doing higher level, then I would suggest that for section B question one, that's that big question that everyone has to do, that there's no escape from. Um, I would recommend that you make sure you know your factors influencing, influencing shopping decisions. Also, to be able to evaluate the nutritional value of a food stuff. Um, consumer trends is likely this year. Um, of all the food types, fish could make a return to the paper. Vitamin D maybe as well. Um, possibly coronary heart disease. They'd be our top picks for the home economics section B question one topic. Um, possibly carbohydrates as well. All right, um, then you have to do two questions then out of question two, three, four, five, all for the same amount of marks. Now, they're on different topics, like question two is generally food related. Question three is usually a home management question. Question four, consumer studies, and question five is all that social worker stuff. Um, for question two, food processing, freezing, food preservation. Red hot topics, likely to make an appearance this year. Um, for question three, your home management question, household budget, to prepare a household budget, um, a health insurance scheme, um, the Higher Purchase Act, 1960. Uh, let's see now, what else? Oh yes, next section. Question four, the consumer studies one. A home management system, very likely. Consumer protection, consumer spending. And finally, for the sociology stuff, the elderly, it's nearly impossible that that's not, not going to be asked this year, it's so likely. Also, um, children's rights, family and parenting roles. They're your most likely topics to come up there in that section. Now, that brings us on to section C. Um, section C, you have to do one question here. Um, I have no interest in the textiles. So there's either the home management section or this extra sociology section. In the home management, your most likely seven topics are house building, planning permission, etc. Types of houses and housing provision, lighting, renewable energy, effects of fuel emissions, um, ventilation, and planning interior design. For the extra sociology, the most likely topics you'd get there, I'll give you five of these. There's work, in general, just work. Um, or possibly women in the workforce, more specifically. Or the impact of technology on work. Basically something to do with work, very likely. Or possibly either adult or second chance education might come up. Um, or else voluntary work. It's all about work. You're going to get something on work, I'd say. All right, that's about it, right? Now, higher level, exciting. But if you're doing the ordinary, then there's a whole different set of predictions for this one. Again, they're arranged in the same kind of order. So um, section B first, question one. Section B, question one, the unavoidable one. And then for each of the other four questions in the section, and then for the section C questions. And remember, you only have to do one of those section C questions. Right, firstly, for ordinary level home economics, section B question one, either menu planning, suggesting complementary foods, um, calcium could come up, or you might get factors influencing shopping decisions, or possibly protein. They're your five most likely ones. Section B, and once again, Section B questions are laid out in the same way as in the higher level. For question two about food, 
your most likely topics to get there for you to get there are additives food spoilage fruit and vegetables or a teenage diet and requirements um, for question three a household budget household insurance consumer rights issues or maybe sale of goods supplier services act it's ridiculous that should be in business not home ec anyway um, then you got your consumer studies might be environment the environment or online shopping or maybe household budget could come up there as well it's hard to say um, finally the sociology question then is going to be most likely adolescents teenagers or else children or possibly marriage and divorce all things that can lead to each other actually interestingly enough uh, then you got your section C I've only got predictions for question one and question three don't bother with question two because you have to knit something or something that's just like I wouldn't be doing that so question one is the one about whatever I don't know I don't care question section C question one what might come up there is either energy efficiency in the home that will include insulation or else cold water supply local authority housing um, electricity or the advantages and disadvantages of renting then for question three the sociology bit there's either unemployment childcare the protection of young persons act 1996 voluntary work or children's allowance there's your five most likely topics there mm -hmm.